Hi just friends, today I'm here on Liches again, 3 plus 2 and um, you know my elo is uh, like 2000 here on Liches and uh, I'm not able to, to increase my elo and uh, this time I played with, with the black pieces and it's not easy for me Re re record a vi recording a video and uh, at the same time uh, playing so I capture this knight uh, okay I prepare to castle okay you want to push uh, and uh, create some damage so I I want I I had I have to defend this pawn so I could defend in this way like queen here okay now I castle and now I play rook here to put pressure on this pawn okay he defend so I think I can play this move Knight capture knight uh, d7 to to play maybe in the future knight uh, knight d5 so yeah I can play knight d5 and now I attack his bishop okay now I can play this move this move or what can I play uh, okay bishop here to put pressure on the a2 pawn and uh, okay he blocked me I wanted to play bishop c4 but with the push he blocked me and now I can play I can play a5 to open up this position. Okay, now I can capture. Can capture. I I can capture this bishop. And now I can simply push. Okay. I want to ruin his pole structure with e e six really soon. So now I can push my light square bishop control uh, square for his knight. So I can hold this. Okay, a four. No. Okay, now I can capture. Okay, now I. I want to double up here and um, I have this target clearly so I continue to put pressure and now I want to, to take this pawn okay he want to open up the position with h4 h5 so I block and maybe in the future bishop g g4 I don't know okay I could pin this knight, bishop uh, b5. Okay, yeah. I can play this move. Bishop here. Okay, you want to play really aggressive, you want to push here. Um, so I have to react about it. I think I have a time to to attack. 
in this way okay he push now i can play this and now i can capture if you try to push i capture this knight okay you attack my my queen but now i can simply capture bishop capture for c4 pawn capture for c4 and now this pawn will be attacked really soon What can I play now? I play queen here, queen b6. Okay, you want to attack me? Rook here. I have to capture Okay, probably I lost Surely I lost I don't know how to resolve this position it's terrible, really terrible for me. I can't hold this position, it's impossible. Yeah, yeah, it's too, too, too slow and uh, I was happy about my position in the first part of the game, but uh, he found a nice way to attack me When I was here, I, I Yeah For computer is a is a good position for me Completely good position for me. Oh, I I miss this move, bishop c4, because this pawn it's pain. Oh, what I miss? But. Here I was in advantage, maybe no, maybe a little. Yeah, there was queen a2, but yeah, I I mistake here. I blunder here. F5, not a move like this, because now it's completely losing position and it's normal that I lost. Okay, another game. Okay, I open with G3 this time. It's a pity that I lost the, the that game for. I didn't see the, that pin. Okay, knight C3. Bishop g2 i want to control d5 square now i push okay bishop g7 i'm not scared about it i play bishop g5 okay and now knight here And now, if he moves his, he moves his knight, uh, I can take his uh, queen. So, 
Okay. I can do a long castle, I think, because I want to put pressure here on on the d6 pawn in this way. Okay. You waste the time. Okay, I can I can push. I can push h4. I think I like h4. Yeah, good move. Now king here, maybe. Yeah. King b1. He can play bishop f5 check. Good move. But now I, I have this... Uh... No, because he can... I would like to play e4. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay, now I think I can play this bishop here. Rook here and now I want to push. I want to push G. Okay, he take my pawn. Oh, he lost a piece, I think. I can take his knight or not. No, because he can capture, he can take his knight, he can capture with the queen. So no, would be a, a terrible blunder. But what happened if I play bishop capture for f6, he can capture with the knight. So it's, it's not a blunder, I continue to, to play in this aggressive way, g4. Oh, we capture, obviously. O okay, maybe it's okay. O or I blunder. I blunder completely. Yeah. What a bad game. Yeah, I, I, I can resign. I lost everything. Yeah. Well, how can I do? I lost too many pieces. I have no way to resist here. There is no move for me. And uh, what can I do here? Nothing. I can't do nothing. I can push, but okay, I resign. Another game. Bishop G three again. Bishop G two again. I blunder too much, simply too much. I can't play in this way, obviously I lose if I play in this way. Knight f3, 
Now I want to castle. No. He push, so. Okay, I can capture. And now I can play bishop d2. It captured my bishop. Knight for d2, queen for d2, and now I prep. I'm ready to castle. I want to defend this pawn. Okay, bring my rook into the game. He probably want to play bishop h3. Yeah, typical move. And now I... Queen d3. Okay, knight uh, g5, and uh, I try to checkmate, so he has to push, probably, g6 is the only way to defend this checkmate, so. And all is then I will take this bishop. I will play king for g2, and... Uh, okay, he pushes the f pawn, so... I can capture and now I want to play knight uh, knight d knight d5 absolutely oh so I have this check I think is good Na uh, queen d is a check so queen d5 and now I can play knight here because too many pieces control the f7 square. What I, I could play here? My knight is... Uh, I have to move my knight, absolutely. So... Oh, I have this combination. Really nice to take some pawn. Yeah, I have queen capture for e5. I defend my knight in this way. Queen capture for d5 is for e5. So in this way, I take a piece. He has to capture now rook or d7. He captured my bishop, but I can play rook for c7 and I gain a pawn and my rook in, is a is a seven rank. I, I think it's a good position for me. I can play knight uh, uh, e6 really soon. Okay, you want to open up the position. So I can play knight e6. I attack his rook and I put pressure here on g7. He has to play maybe rook here so i'm not scared about this move rook g8 will be a really passive position yes i think i i i won this game for this tactic okay rook here so now I can play knight here, knight for g7. I, I continue to attack his rook, so he has no time. So, and now I could play something like uh, 
What I can put this, this night? Oh, maybe this. Knight, uh, knight uh, f5. With the idea to play knight h6 and knight. Uh... Okay, he continued to put pressure. But I think I can resist. I have this. Uh... I could play knight d6 and uh, to attack this pawn to, to do some check. Uh, okay, I prefer this knight uh, knight uh, h6, and uh, I attack his rook, and I want to play knight f7 check. So now is check, and now knight uh, g5 is really strong i put pressure on this pawn on h7 i will take another pawn so he can push nothing here i think okay he push i can take and now i can simply take Yeah, my position is completely good. Okay, he want to bring another rook into the game. So I can play simply rook here. Rook e. Okay, I defend my knight. Now I want to play rook here. Rookie one and okay, simply H four. We have to move uh, really fast. No, I blunder. I can't believe it. it's incredible. I blunder because I move too fast, and uh, now I lost. I'm so terrible player, really. I can't do nothing. Really nothing. Yeah. <laughs> I have no words to... I don't know how to say what to say really. Okay, so um, it's okay. I use uh, a nice tactic to to gain uh, a, a pawn and a better position. After this move, I was in a winning position because queen here is too strong. So can you see? My position was so good here in this. I have to learn to move uh, more fast, but faster because uh, in this way I, I can't lose a game like this because I play rookie, rookie seven and I blunder the rook. This move, rook, e seven. <laughs> so it's okay. So thank you really much for watching my video. And remember to subscribe to my channel and see you soon with another video. Bye.